Hillsborough Hills Rosad and our youth traffic safety project is called Keep Your Summer Drive Alive. Well, our traffic safety project involved a lot of key aspects. We had something called Grim Reaper Day. We had pre-selected students based upon situations that we believed based on their background, information we knew about them. And we based their scenario in which they were killed based upon a situation that could actually happen to them. And then we went into the class and one of our traffic safety team members was dressed up as the Grim Reaper. And he went into the class and he said their name. And then the police officer, Officer Aventi, that was with us, she read the scenario in which they were killed. Tessa. He was on the passenger seat of her boyfriend's car. He was driving too fast and he came upon a rough. And we escorted them into a private room in the office. And we read them their scenario and we got an interview with them about their last words they wish they could say and some tips for other drivers on the road today. If you are too tired to drive home, call your mom, let her know, if, or ask if you can stay where you are, or at a friend's house. If there's a girl, then stay somewhere else, I guess, for the guy. Because my mom wouldn't appreciate that too much. But These are all local. They looked at some pictures that actually happened in our county, Trail County. There was accidents from actually the previous Saturday morning from a train track. And the reactions that we got out of most of the people were actually really empowering. I think a lot of people learned that you do need to be safe on the road and you definitely need to keep your distractions to a minimum. I think it helped that we added people from different social groups because it added to the whole diversity of the project and it made it more meaningful. Today we taught the 8th graders a lesson about driving safely. They'll be taking driver's ed this summer so it's really important they know about that. They watched a video called Take Care Before It's Too Late. Drivers aged 20 and younger made up only 9% of all drivers in North Dakota in 2005. That age group suffered 24% of all crash related injuries. That means that about one out of every four people injured in a crash are aged 20 or younger. And then we gave them a pre-test and post-test. I think it was really beneficial. On the Sydney course, it was like a go-kart and then you had to drive around this track. They could control when you were driving impaired or driving normal. And then they gave you just like a little speech about this is what it's like when you drive drunk and it's not good. Our community night, which was our annual steak and chicken supper fry, which is really good, was basically all about showcasing the kids that make the right decisions. And we did this by showing our Take Care Before It's Too Late video. And we showed our new SAD video, which involved all of the members of our chapter. SAD is giving me the... SAD really helps you get involved. SAD is kind of like... Confidence to be able to step up and say no. Our escape. We did a presentation called Breakdown. An expert on relationships now. You know better than Rhea. <laughs> and we all did this while enjoying some great North Dakota food. Um, we had to do it for the community too, so it wasn't just the kids that were affected by it. Like, like even adults do the same things that kids do, and they need to be aware of all like theme traffic safety and stuff. This project was a lot of work, but it was also a lot of fun. I think it made a big impact in our school and also our community. So do a favor for us and yourself and keep your summer drive alive. So starting May 11th through the 22nd, go to actoutloud.org and vote for Hillsborough!